Hi, everybody. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Okay, wait one second. There we go. Okay. So, good evening, everybody. Thanks a lot for joining today's class. Gracias por estar con nosotros desde bien, bien tempranito. How are you doing? ¿Cómo les está yendo en su miércoles? Everything good? In... Hi, teacher. Hi, Ignacio. How are you? Fine, fine. In the in the, my in our in our job today is a lot um, the how much work for our coworker. Um, you mean there was like a lot of work? It, for it's the. We 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 are the client of the Don Bosco University. They 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 bring our service. Give me one and, second. And today, and today, uh, and our work too much work for this this project. <clears throat> I'm here. And thank you. Thank you so much for that. Give me just a second. Creo que um, me escucharon doble un momentito. <laughs> I oh. think that I was like with a lot of echo. So just allow me one second here. Um, yeah, I don't know what's going on. It's working. Okay. Okay, so thank you so much, Ignacio. Thank you so much for, for joining, right? In spite of all the difficulties that you're having at work, but it's truly appreciated. Um, and thanks everybody as well for joining today. Espero que hayan tenido un muy buen Wednesday, that um, everything was smooth and good. And uh, we are going to get started today with our session number, let's go sec here. So number 10. El día de ahora terminamos la segunda semana. We are finishing week number two, which is amazing. Estamos ya a la mitad really? del, del módulo, right? Yeah, we are like oh. in the middle of the module. And uh, so el día de mañana comenzamos con la unidad número 3 y ya vamos de bajada, you know. So we call it this way, siempre que vamos a la mitad es como el tiempo se nos va a ir súper rápido. Así que, yeah. thank you so much. Eh, this module, siento que eh, se están presionando mucho más. You're practicing more. Uh, you're using your vocabulary more. And that's amazing. Espero que también vayan trabajando con su meta personal. Aprenderse los verbos, aprender vocabulario, practicar un poquito más de listening, right? And, uh, porque eso les va a ayudar a ustedes a encontrar también eh, su punto de aprendizaje, right? Todos aprendemos de forma diferente. Siempre recordemos que a veces hay compañeros que sienten que van más rápido, you know, and ya se saltaron dos, tres bardas. Usted todavía está en la primera. No se preocupe. Todos aprendemos de formas diferentes. Probably, eh, a mí me cuesta más speaking, pero tenga un muy buen oído, right? Eh, adecuado mi oído para que uh, lo he trabajado un poquito más. Escucho música o I listen to videos. Entonces, remember that everybody learns in a different way. Para algunos, grammar es más difícil. Para otros, pronunciation. Para otros, son muy buenos, pero solo está el miedo ahí que me voy a equivocar. Así que, everybody has... Eh, una meta diferente. So just keep in mind, guys, and, uh, y pues nada, sigamos trabajando. So keep on practicing, estamos a un pasito de intermedio, and, and I'm super excited to see, eh, to see you, like, very, very early. Um, para del inicio, guys, voy a tomar asistencia, so let me just go and take attendance. Mm -hmm. Si me ayudan con su camarita, please, that would be beautiful. So I can have everybody on cam. 
And uh, let me just a second. Let me take it here. So, Anita, is that what it is? Anita. Hello, Miss. Um, Hola, Anita, how are you? Thank you Bye, so teacher. much. Brian? Present, teacher. Hey, Brian, good evening. Good evening. Thanks for joining. Let me see. Just give me one second. Here. Okay. Here we go. Is Danny? Danny's? Present. Are you feeling better? Just un poco mejor? Um, so, so. No. It's tired. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. pero ya casi terminamos. So we are just almost done. Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, Sarai? Present teacher. Gracias, Miss. Eduardo? And. Thank you, Eduardo. Uh, Guadalupe? Present, Miss. Thank you so much. Jacqueline? Present, Miss. Jackie, Jackie. Gracias, Miss. Thank you so much. Jocelyn? Present teacher. Thank you. Ignacio? Present teacher. Amazing. Marvin? Present, present. Well, well, tengo a los dos Marvin acá. Me alegro mucho. <laughs> I'm happy to see you guys. Hi, Mr. Lopez. Hi, Alex. So thanks a lot. Present teacher. Thank you. Alex, ¿está trabajando todavía? Are you working? Yes, I'm working in the street. Oh, okay. Gracias, le agradezco enormemente por conectarse en Spike. Please be careful. Um, I got Clary. Por ahí got Clary. Hello, Miss. I am present. Good evening. Thank you, Miss. Uh, Moses. Clary. Norbert. Norbert, yeah. I skipped your name. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Moses no está acá. I don't see Moses. Ven, ve al, ven a Moises. No. Not no. yet, right? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Nelson? Nelson? Pedrina? Hello. 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 En el chale, en el break. <laughs> Por ahí vi a Pedrina también. I saw her really. Yes, there we go. Uh, Renee? Yet, Richard. Hello, hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Thank okay. you. Your voice is very energetic. <laughs> it's very lively. <laughs> cool. Mabel. Yes, and teacher. Gracias, Miss. Thank you so much. Eh, Brenda. Oh, right. Brenda tiene un conveniente. Yes, guys, Brenda is having um, a little bit of a hard situation. Si le puede mandar un mensajito, you know, the support, that would be beautiful as well, you know. Um, Carlos. Hello, present. Thank you, Claudia. Claudia, where are you? Todavía no. Eh, Karina. Karina, si la vi super early. Thank you, Miss. Thank you so much. Okay, so just let me make sure I got everybody. Nelson, I'm missing Nelson, and I'm missing Renee. Yeah, missing them. Okay, good, 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 good. No problem. Give me just a second. Solo me cambio de, uh, de host. Give me one second. Sí, ahí está. Okay. Let me see. Yeah, much better. Okay. Okay, guys. So let me just uh, present my station give me one second here okay okie dokie 
Let me present my screen. Okay, guys. So as I mentioned before, vamos a terminar ahora la unidad número dos. Gracias a quienes ya me avanzaron con la plataforma, quienes ya la terminaron, right? quienes todavía me faltan, no se preocupen. Eh, tienen hasta el día de ahora para poder completarla. So you have until today. Si pueden avanzar más, please do it. Así ya no se quedan con aquel compromiso de me falta, el eh, tiempo no me alcanza, sino que pueden hacerlo like, desde su teléfono en un par de minutitos libres, right? Um, so let's just get started here. As a warm up, tenemos acá previous class vocabulary review. Tenemos 30 seconds talk. El día de ayer comenzamos con 30 seconds talk. Dijimos que lo íbamos a ir agregando poquito a poquito, right? Vamos a irlo subiendo hasta que llegamos a dos minutos, tres minutos, hablando lo que sea, lo que podamos about an specific topic. Y para que empecemos ya a pensar también y no traducirlo tanto, right? Que sea un poco más automatizado. Now, to get started, sí vamos a comenzar con 30 segundos para calentar un poquito, right? <laughs> para que nuestro cerebro empiece a pensar en English too and you get ready for this. Um, yesterday, eh, tuvimos algunos compañeros al inicio. Hopefully today we can listen to other people. And um, so... I uh, would like to know if I have some volunteers. Alguien quiere ser voluntario. So, les doy el tema. I will give you un tema cualquiera, a random topic. Y lo único que vamos a hacer es hablar de ese tema por 30 segundos. Talk about that for 30 seconds sin detenerse non-stop. Um, yes. Uh, I, I want to participate. Uh, sure, sure. That's nice. But, but today I will be a police on a patrol. patrol uh, oh, oh, wait, wait a second. Wait a second, porque esa sí va de un minuto. <laughs> so, esos son los empleos, uh, right? Que estuvimos viendo todo. el día de ayer. No, sí, ya todo está listo. Nice. He's ready. <laughs> exactly. Remember that at the end of the class, we said eh, habían un par de compañeros exonerados porque lo hicieron ayer, but the rest of you tenían one minute talk sobre un empleo eh, un poco diferente que teníamos ahí, como hablar de las obligations, talk about the duties, y explicar un poquito qué es lo que hacen. So, um, this topic, eh, Ignacio, is going to be um, random, okay, es un tema cualquiera, it's going to be a random topic, so, um, but it's okay, nos puede ayudar, it's totally fine. Um, le voy a dar el tema, I'm going to give you the topic, I'm going to set the 30 seconds, y solamente compártanos sin detenerse, without stopping, utilice frases, eh, si no recuerda, no sabe qué decir, Agregue como, let me think, that's difficult, I don't know what to say, <laughs> pero sigue hablando, right, just keep on talking. Um, 30 segundos, talk about my favorite animal. <laughs> no, let's talk about cats, I don't like cats. <laughs> okay, but, uh, but I will give you this one so you can tell us about, um, well, you can tell us your opinion about it. So, 30 seconds, Ignacio. 30 seconds. Listo? Are you ready? Yes. For me, it's a surprise, but I, I, I can speak about the cat. Mm -hmm. The cat is not favorite for me, and I prefer the dog. Uh, for example, my this moment, I have my, my dog is a girl. Her name is Burbuja. Burbur, yeah. And uh, she's a, she's a, like a children because they uh, to time is to, over. <laughs> Beautiful, nice description, good vocabulary, good grammar, muy buena conexión uh, de ideas. Good, Ignacio, that was really good. All right, and time is over. Guys, any other volunteer? Tenemos más voluntarios, or we can go by big teams if you prefer. Hi, Richard. Okay, Richard, perfect. Oh, That's okay. Okay, amazing. So, Richard, I'll give you the topic. Okay. Uh, try to connect your ideas. Utilice conectores also and 
Um, later, si es un proceso, later, finally, first, second, right? Para que nos dé un poco más de cohesión de idea. So, let me give it to you. The topic is going to be really easy. Well, yo creo que easy. <laughs> so, the topic Batman. is Batman. Yes. Okay. Okay, Batman. Okay. Eh, 30 seconds. Um, dicen, uh, no, no, eh, eh, night. Uh, eh, enemy Joker. Yes, uh, and a movie, a movie, a uh, uh, star, eh, Bati Cueva, eh, Bati Mobile, um, yes, a eh, uh, Murciélago, eh, a que más, que más, que más, a ah, Acertijo, a ah, Friend, over. Friend Joker. <laughs> Sorry, I have to stop you. Time is over. Thank you so much. Yeah, you try to uh, come up with vocabulary. Very good. Yeah, murciélago is bat. <laughs> you ah, okay. get it. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, it's bat. Okay. But. Thank you so much, Richard. Very good. Anybody else who wants to go next? Volunteers? <laughs> Perfect, Karina. Nice, nice. So 30 seconds. Try to use, you know, some connectors to put your ideas together. And your topic is roses. roses. <laughs> yeah, okay. roses. So 30 uh, seconds. Uh, dance roses. Yeah. Now, nah, yes, roses. <laughs> okay, ready? Yes. Perfect. Let's okay. do it. Roses is one of the most beautiful uh, flowers because you can buy for a gift for a mother's days or um or for your girlfriend or for your aunt i don't know um, the rose have many kind of rose uh, different colors different shapes and they are so really beautiful time and is over <laughs> Thank you so much. That was nice. The way you added those little details, like the most beautiful, and you tried to tell us or describe it, that was very cool. That was really good. Thank you so much for that. Um, next volunteer. I want to select victims, you know. <laughs> okay, volunteers. Hi. Anybody else? Okay, Danny is perfect. Thank you. So Danis, your topic is Danis, are you familiar with Doctor House? Uh, no. 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 Okay. Yeah, I want to find somebody you know. All right. Um, sorry, Dan. sorry, but but Karina, don't speak about the smell, the rose. Oh, the, the smell. Yeah. Why she mentioned there are different <laughs> types. <laughs> So yeah. I guess that refers to everything. Okay. So, um, okay. So, como estamos con simple present, let's go with this one, uh, Danis. Let's talk about Superman. And Superman. every, yeah. And let's use it. Utilizamos everything you can. Los poderes. What he can do, what he cannot do, etc. So, okay. um, 30 segundos, 30 seconds. Go. Okay. Uh... Go. <laughs> uh, Wait. Cri 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 no, 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 not ever, not ever. I am the, the Superwoman. Right? Superman Superwoman. Is, my daughter is Superwoman. Or oh, the daughter is uh, the, the Superman. And time yeah. is over. <laughs> Sorry, I have to stop you. Okay. That is a really beautiful way to say it. So you are yeah. your daughter, Superman. Yeah. Okay. 
And I guess uh, our parents, you know, so they are our heroes, right? So nice. Thanks a lot for sharing that. Good. Okay. And I need one more person, guys, who wants to volunteer. I, your, I teacher. Yes, amazing. Okay, good, good, good. Um, so, Alex, are you familiar with the... Um, Yo iba a hablar de, de, de mi gusto de las películas. Wait. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, I can take it. <laughs> That's okay. Son 30 segundos, so I don't think you will have enough time, but let's do it. Lo que nos pueda compartir. Mm -hmm. 30 seconds. Go, Alex. Hi, class. Este, I like going... I like watch most the movie, ¿verdad? I like going to the movies, um, the cinema. Um, my favorite uh, movie, uh, the, the name is The Youth. Uh, the movie is a uh, lawyer must defend his uh, father, ¿verdad? Who is um, a youth, youth of the people in the country. Time is over. <laughs> I have to stop you. <laughs> All right. Wait, wait. Are we talking about Robert Downey Jr.'s movie? Yes, yes. Oh, I love okay. The, the judge. The, the judge. The mm -hmm. judge. Uh, El juez, right? The judge. All right. Yeah. Is that a good movie? Yes, yes. It's my favorite movie for the, oh. the la temática, the theme. Oh, interesting. I mean, la he escuchado. I have heard about it, pero nunca la he visto. I have never seen it. So, pero sí, me la habían recomendado. Pero sí. creo que es drama, right? It's like drama. Yes, yes, it's drama. It's like drama, a sad yeah. story. No. You cry. Did you cry? No, 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 teacher. No lo no. puedo decir. La cosa que the youth kill a people. Eh, entonces, In an accident, yeah. right? Yes. Yes, entonces eh, the, co eh, the family call uh, the lawyer in the family que es uh, son de de youth y él él lo defiende. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean uh, the act uh, the actor is Downey Jr. So creo que solo por eso la veré. <laughs> So I think it is worth watching. Thank you, Alex. That was a very good description. Good. So that is the judge, como el juez. So the judge. Thank you. Okay, guys. So no victims por esta ronda, pero wait. We are going to have a lot of opportunities for you to practice today. So let's move on a little bit. Eh, ahora tenemos one on one con, well, con Ignacio. So, si me regalas some minutes later, Ignacio, that would be great. Now, in the meantime, vamos a trabajar un poquito con lectura. We are going to work a little bit with reading, right? Um, so, eso es un schedule. This is like a sort of a schedule that the company has. But to get us started, let's take a look at the following. Um, this is in your book. Les voy a compartir el libro. Give me one second. Okay. So this is in your book and this is in page number 27. So you have a stuff in the schedules. Y está bastante larguito. It's kind of long. So, vamos a aplicar técnicas de lectura. No necesitamos leerlo paso a paso, palabra por palabra. We don't really need it. So vamos a irnos directo a la respuesta, a las preguntas o a la actividad y buscamos la respuesta, right? We are going to look for this. So let's take a look at the exercise we have to complete here. Uh, this one, it says here, read the following schedule of the restaurant managers and write the time of each event. So ayúdenme encontrando la hora. I need your help, right? Uh, finding the time for each of these activities. So let me make it bigger. So this is the one. For example, check temperature at the kitchen. What time do they check the temperature? So. 11 a.m. 9.40. The order, teacher. 
Yeah, the, the hour, exactly. What time? Oh. What time do they check the temperature? 9.40 yeah. a.m. 9.40 a.m. Oh, 9.40 a.m. it says, look yeah. around and yeah. check the yeah. temperature. Yeah. Mm. Pero entonces no solamente es una hora. So, check the temperature in all the coolers and freezers, 9.40. Veamos que dice abajo. Check the temperature at the kitchen. Y a las 11, you said. At 11, go to the kitchen and check the temperature. So, um, oh. tenemos dos horas diferentes. We have two different yeah. times, and that's okay. So, 9.40 and, and 11 a.m., right? So, that's okay. Yeah. So, we are good. Number two, turn on the lights and sound system. What time? I know. I, I know. <laughs> what? <laughs> why not? <laughs> okay, why not, guys? All right. So, turn on the lights and sound system. What time? Seven? Yeah. Seven? Eight? Eight. Ten? Ten. Ten, yeah, ten, um, up ten minutes, a.m. Okay. So, ten in ten minutes, turn on, on, okay, the lights and the sound system, very good, good, good. All right, what about the next one? It says, make the schedule for the second shift. What time do they make the schedule for the second shift? What time do they make the schedule? For ten p.m. Four, you said. Four p.m. Then. Oh, for ten. Okay, ten. make a schedule for the second shift. Okay, very good, guys. What about open the back kitchen door? What time do they open the back kitchen door? Back kitchen door. Oh. What time? Uh, 9.30 a.m. All right, so 9.30, exactly. So 9.30, they open the back kitchen door. Okay, very oh. good, exactly. That's the answer. And the last one that we have says, turn on the open sign. So what time do they turn on the open sign? 10 p.m. 10 p.m.? Okay, wait, it says turn. This is turn on, encender, right? Vaya, ah, okay. gamma. Gamma. Then. No, no, no. Ooh. Ooh. Sorry, I think I muted you. Okay, so um, what about the last one, guys? The last one says. Uh, turn on the open sign. So, no es apagar, right? It says turn on. So, ¿a qué hora le enciende? What time do they turn it on? It is here in the, it's in the morning. What time? 10 and 10. 10, 10. Um, no. 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 So it is not 10 and 10. What is the other possibility? Uh, Buscamos la palabra open, like open sign. Open sign is... Mm -hmm. 10 p.m. 10 a.m. Let's check it out. 10 a.m. says servers start to clock in. Mm, no. 10 p.m. 10 p.m. Oh, but uh, 10 p.m. 
eh, sería como el que la apagan. They turn it off. Oh, pero necesitamos que la enciendan. So what time do they turn it on? Ten. Yes, ten fifty-five. Open the front door and turn on oh. the open sign. Exactly. Very good, Carlos. Carlos, welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining. All right. Hello, Hello there. Yes. Are you finished with your yes. activities? Oh, great. Yes. Uh, the problem was that the teacher uh, begin, began the class 15 Late. minutes uh, later. Oh, so tell the teacher that he's uh, stealing time <laughs> from mine. <laughs> okay, no, but thank you so much for that. Thanks for uh, joining. Jocelyn, you look very relaxed today. <laughs> I so envy you, really cool. Enjoy it, that's amazing. Imagination with Thank you, teacher. Yes, like yes. when you are in the bajo del arbolito, right? Yes, yes. <laughs> Under the mango tree. Oh, yes, yes. cool, cool, cool. Uh -huh, with a soda too. All right, guys, let's take a look at this part. Here we have. Complete the sentences with the simple present form of the verse in parentheses. Revisamos un poquito this part. Um, again, esto es en su material. This is in your material. Um, lo puede revisar. You can check it out. Uh, you can print it. You can complete it. So you have it there. Now, number one. Ayúdenme con la primera, please. Help me with the first. Jeff, it says work. ¿Qué cambios le necesito hacer a work? Jeff. Works. Jeff works from 6 a.m. to 4 p.m. Exactly. What about number two? Jane and Pete? Clean or cleans? Clean. Clean. Exactly. Clean, right? Okay, very good. What about number three? Mark? And this is negative. ¿Cómo le hago negativa? How can I make it negative? Don't does doesn't doesn't, doesn't exactly take. very good. Mark doesn't take orders on Wednesday. Okay, nice. What about number four? A restaurant. Yeah. Open. Open. Okay. Open. O le Opens. Open. No. Only open. Open. Um, I have a question. Is singular or is plural? Opens. Restaurant. Open. 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 Singular. Singular. Okay. singular. Restaurant is singular. Yeah. Y a lo singular le agrego o no le agrego a este? No, no se agrega. Terceras personas yes. singulares? Yes, 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 miss. Open. Yes. Entonces vamos a hacer un pequeño cambio con restaurant. So a restaurant opens. Le vamos a agregar S, right? Uh, porque solo es uno. Si acá estuviera la letra S, like a restaurants, como plural, entonces no necesito agregarle anything else. So that would be just fine. So remember third person singular, le agrego S. Now, number five. No le pongamos atención a our. Our no tiene nada que ver con si es singular o plural. Our solamente me indica la relación con de quién es, right? So, our, nuestro, pero no me da ni singular ni plural. No me lo cambia. So, here, enfoquémonos en vos. Our boss es singular o plural. What do you think? Singular or plural? La palabra vos. Singular. Singular. So, ¿cómo cambia el verbo? Our boss. Spend. Ahí está bien, va. Spend o spends. 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 Le agrego S. Exactly. Our yeah. boss spends much time in the restaurant. Very good. Number six. We. Negative. We don't or we doesn't. Don't. We don't close on Sunday, exactly. And the last one that is number seven, they expect or expects. 
to have more clients this week. ¿Cuál sería la más adecuada? Expect or expects con la S al final. Oh, yeah. Only expect. Exactly. Only expect, right? Without letter S. Okay. Very good. Okay. <laughs> All right. So let's take a look at the following. I have for you a little bit of a speaking practice. As I said, vamos a intentar empezar a, a pensar, right? Um, a decirle a nuestro cerebro, okay, no traduzcas todo, intenta también tener unas palabras más cerquita para que sea más fácil hablar. Take a look at this one. It says, um, I have six questions. So, what I want you to do is really, really easy. What I want you to do is, um, vamos a ir a los grupos really quick. Discutan las seis. But again, no solamente vamos a dar una respuesta de sí, no, algo cortito. Line number one says, what job would be perfect for you? Hay empleos raros. There are really weird jobs. But this one, no es como su empleo ideal o el empleo que tiene, no. It says, what job would be perfect for you? Piensen en lo que les gusta, you know? Um, ¿Y qué empleo se relaciona con eso? For example, in my case, uh, I think it's really difficult, but I love um, meeting and going to different places. So the job that would be perfect for me maybe is... Um, uh, a tour guide, probably. <laughs> I would love to be a tour guide um, because a tour guide uh, tells you uh, stories and goes to different places and everything is free. You don't need to pay. <laughs> okay. So, no solamente decimos el empleo, sino que también describimos por qué, right? If it is possible, ¿qué es lo que hacen? Number two, what is the easiest job? The easiest means el más fácil. For you, ¿cuál es el empleo más fácil? The easiest job in the world. Um, piensen, ayer vimos una lista de empleos. You can take it from there. That's okay. Number three, what is the hardest? El más difícil, the hardest job and why. Todas van con un porqué, right? Which job pays the most. So, ¿en qué empleo puede ganar más dinero? Which job pays the most? I mean, El hablamos Salvador. del Salvador, talking about El Salvador, talking about our country. So, what, which jobs pays the most? Pero un empleo digno. <laughs> no, I mean, it's fine. <laughs> if you consider that uh -huh, a congress, oh, by the way, ¿cómo digo Salvador. diputado? <laughs> How can I say, what? How can I say diputado? No, empleo digno, guys. Okay. So, ese, ese, es digno, ese es digno de ganar bastante. ¿Any idea how to say diputado? No, no, no. No. Okay, se lo comparto. So let me share that. That is a congressman. Congress. So congressman or congresswoman, right? So congressman, congresswoman, oh. es como el congreso, oh. eso es un diputado. Ah, okay. mm -hmm. That is... Uh -huh. eh, Alex mencionó antes también la palabra judge, right? Como un juez, all right. Um, well, no, no. no creo que Richard <risa> eh, tiene por ahí eh, el empleo de sus sueños. <risa> okay, that's okay, that's okay. <risa> Lo voy a compartir, aunque no debería, but <risa> es vocabulario al final del día. So that's a drug dealer, okay. I don't, no se lo Me recomiendo. I don't think it's a good idea, but okay. <laughs> okay. No, pero ese es el nombre del, del empleo. En caso alguna vez estén escuchando algo. Me contratan. Um, so that is the word. Like, come on. <laughs> okay. Esa palabra, váyanse. What? Si váyanse. Esa palabra es firmen. <laughs> okay, <laughs> then number five says, what is the most dangerous job, right? Como el más eh, peligroso. I mean, no necesariamente eh, um, hay empleos de policía, you know, uh, or army. Hay empleos que son realmente peligrosos. Por eso. Lions. Por eso. Lions. Okay. Lions. Exactly. People who work in the zoo, 
um, una vez vi a estos limpiadores de skyscraper, los que limpian las ventanas, los ventanales de los edificios super altos. Oh. Ajá, uh, I mean, there are people que se sube solo con el arnés, you know. Spider-Man. And, and they look like a Spider-Man because yeah. they clean it de la parte de afuera. I mean, se subirían. Would you do that? For example, a la torre, a la torre city. He visto la afuera, no. you know, people yes. cleaning the windows. But, Well, in other countries, it is considered a really dangerous job. Yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, no necesariamente being a police officer, right? Um, yeah. People who work in the zoo with animals. ¿Qué yeah. otro empleo uh, se les ocurre? Oh, electrician. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Guys, a mí me agarra la corriente por todo. <laughs> uh, you know, so if I am in the computer one whole day, y luego toco a alguien, se siente como, you know, so, uh, exactly, so I wouldn't be an electrician, for me that's very dangerous, so, yeah. pensemos like outside the box, que otro empleo you consider could be dangerous, y la última, what is a job you could never do, un empleo que nunca harían, right, something that you say, mm, 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 this is not for me, um, have you thought about oh, it? Well. <laughs> What is it? Congressman. Oh, um, nunca lo haría. You wouldn't no. do it. No. Why not? No, no creo, no creo. Uh, <laughs> a dollar, money, money. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yo sé que sí. Okay. Why? So, eh, ¿Por qué lo harían o por qué no lo harían? Ah, eh, Why? Eh, un, empleo, un empleo que no, 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 no like it. Uh, service claim. No. Like customer service? No. No like it. Ok. No. Ok, so, vimos anteriormente esta forma de responder. So, vamos a utilizarla ahorita. We can use I would, I would be. Ok, podemos utilizar el I would, yo sería, right? Uh, o me gustaría ser. I would like to be. So, I would like to be. O la negativa, por supuesto. In this case, con la última, what is a job that you wouldn't like to do o que usted nunca haría. I wouldn't like to be. Ah, ¿Qué es algo que no me gustaría? What is something you wouldn't like to? Maybe, oh my God, this is a little difficult for me, but maybe okay. I wouldn't like to be a chef. Probably that's for me. I don't like cooking. <laughs> No. Okay. I mean, I cook in a survival level. <laughs> I cook because <laughs> I need to eat. But no. I don't no no, I mean, but like cooking for a lot of people, cooking for events. Yeah. I ah. think it's I don't I wouldn't like to be a chef. And no, y se queman horrible. So they burn their yes. their hands a lot. They are under a lot of stress all the time so i wouldn't like to be a chef because i don't i don't know that's not for me probably so vamos a intentar explicar siempre we're trying uh, to explain yes, yes ignacio for me, for me it's easy because i don't speak uh, quickly mm -hmm. i would i wouldn't like to be a sealer a sealer like a sailor Vendedor. Oh, a salesperson. Oh, okay, a salesperson. Why not? Yeah, because I don't speak quickly, and the sealer may need to to your your word flow. The, the your word is is quickly. In, in, if I don't can is to buy any product. Yeah. That's right. And also you need something very important. In Spanish, we call it labia. <laughs> so you need to yeah. persuade, to convince people. <laughs> no, but to, okay. I, I can't convince nobody. Okay, you cannot convince people. So um, now that um, Ignacio mentioned this, tenemos la palabra salesperson, right? Que es vendedor. Seller también es vendedor. Or tenemos la palabra businessman, que son comerciantes. 
si usted tiene un negocio de lo que sea pequeño o grande, you are a businessman uh, or a business woman, right? So, este es negociante, comerciante, vendedor. We can also use businessman for that. So, guys, um, is it clear lo que vamos a hacer? Is that right? So, listen to your classmates, of course. Remember, al escuchar los compañeros, estoy entrenando mi oído. So, we really need to listen to your classmates to get ideas, too. Um, intenten entenderles, you know. Y si no le comprenden, be honest and tell them. Can you please repeat that? Okay, I, I want to get the whole idea. Porque es la idea también, comunicarse. So, pueden tomar la captura. You can take a picture. And uh, intenten siempre dar un porqué, right? Why? Try to always say a why. And guys, I'm sending you the invitations. Tenemos eh, like five, seven minutes to talk about it. Luego venimos y los presentamos. 30 seconds talk. Así que let's do it, guys. Let's go right now. And we're good. Yeah, okay, let's go.
All right, guys. So thanks a lot for coming back. We were just uh, listening to your opinion, uh, listening um, to what you think are the easiest, the hardest, the most, uh, the jobs with the best paid, etc. So let's do the following. At the very beginning of the class, comenzamos con 30 segundos talk. Vamos con la segunda ronda de 30 seconds talk, especialmente los que um, no han tenido la oportunidad. You know, I want to give everybody the chance to participate. And, uh, and of course, eh, escucharlos, saber cómo estamos, you know, and uh, saber qué necesitamos tú para mejorar. Um, and of course, tenemos tarea para el día de ahora de el minuto so Eso todavía no, that one is going to wait um, until we finish with this part. So in the meantime, tengo algún voluntario? Do I have any volunteer? ¿Alguien le gustaría um, go for the 30 second practice? De los compañeros que no los hemos escuchado so far. So if no volunteers, let me go and select. Okay. So the first person, da, 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 da. creo que Carlos está teniendo dificultades con el audio. Hello. Eh, ahí estamos. Perfect. Claudia, hi Claudia, good evening. Gracias por conectarse, Miss. Thank you so much for coming. Creo que vi a Brendita también por ahí. Okay, so Brenda. Okay, so, da, 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 da. hi Moses, no, yo lo había visto, <laughs> uh, yeah, I had seen you, I forgot, me falta René, I'm missing René, okay, deme solo un segundito, give me just a sec, Okay, guys, so vamos a ir por los 30 segundos. Let's get started with the 30 seconds. Voy a dejar que ustedes escojan la pregunta you want to answer, pero son 30 segundos intentando brindarnos una explicación, right? So, uh, Brian, comienza con usted. I get started with you. Uh, Brian, Brian, ¿está por acá? Are you around? I guess no. Hello, teacher. Okay. Oh, Carlos, thank you. Hi. Hello. Okay, Carlos, I'm going to take you. <laughs> okay, voy a aprovechar que you know you, um, that you volunteered for this activity. So, solamente seleccionar un tema, select una de las preguntas that you see here, y cuéntanos por 30 segundos sobre eso. Give us some information. Okay. So, Guys, les voy a pedir cinco, al menos cinco oraciones completitas en 30 segundos. I think we can do it. So, Carlos, eh, give us the number y cuéntenos un poquito. Uh, the four. Mm -hmm. Which Perfect. Which is the most? Perfect. Uh, Let's do it. The world, uh, the, the, the job better, uh, with better pace is the petroleum men. The people that are working in, how do you say, pozo? In the wells? In the wells and excavation, the, the holes to obtain petroleum. Okay. The people uh, win, and then they have win. Yeah. They earn really good money. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Thank you so much. That was all right. And the time is over. <laughs> Carlos, thank you for sharing that. Yeah, you're probably right. That is like a business with a lot of money on it. All right. Thank you. Um, guys, who is next? Um, Clary, Clary is up already. Yes, Miss. Perfect. Okay, Claudia, I want to listen to your beautiful voice. So 30 seconds, only 30 seconds. Stop. Escoge el tema that you consider not, is more interesting for you. I know already. <laughs> no, no worries. Acá le ayudamos. So we can help you here. 
si necesita ayuda with any word. So, um, and that's why. Puedes coger el que, el que considere que es um, easier for you o del que tenga como uh, más. What is the most, what is the most dangerous job? Okay, perfect. So, for thank me you for is, mm -hmm. okay. What is the most dangerous job? For me is um, fireman. Uh, Miss, as you say, bombero, right? Yes, yes, yes. You're doing uh, fine. Uh, the fireman is a saber, saber the people and in the thing, so in the house, in the building. Okay. Continue, continue. Is the uh, is the job is the job just a uh, and time is over. It's only 30 seconds. But you did it say, no me quiero quedar con la duda. Dígame, how dígame. Do say, how do you say the farmer man is, que es un servicio generoso? It's a kind service. It's a generous service. So we can use kind or generous. Kind. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. okay. Kind or generous. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's the one. Thank you so much, eh, Clary. That was quite fine. So we got your information. Let me select another person. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I'll go with, I'll go with, let me check. Eh, Pedrina está por acá. Déjeme ver si escribió. Let me see. Not today. All right. Um, Marvin. Well, actually, Mr. Lopez. Are you ready, Mr. Lopez? Would you like to give it a try? Teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello. Intentamos select one topic. Una pregunta de la uno a la seis. Select one of them, right? And... Uh, Tell us lo que sea, anything. So puede intentarnos, um, you know, uh, talk about it. O de no solo vocabulario. The idea is say something, right? Intente contarnos algo, lo que pueda. Whatever you can. So uh, seleccione el que, se le, el que considere más fácil. From one to six. Uh, question five. Okay. What is the most dangerous job? All right, okay, okay. Son 30 segundos, Alex. Uh, well, también es Alex. <laughs> okay, son 30 segundos, Marvin. So, si necesita una palabra en español, dígale en español y siga, right? Try, give it a try. So, let's do it. Uh, for example, the most dangerous job, uh, actually, the the doctor mm -hmm. why effect uh, uh, of the the pandemia mm -hmm. pandemic um, um, uh, mm -hmm. anything um, else <laughs> uh, the uh, that difficult mm -hmm. uh, Anything else you can tell us about doctors? And actually, Only time teacher. is over. <laughs> and actually, time is over. Thank you, uh, uh, Marvin. Like, you did it nicely. You did it really nicely. So, um, that is the idea. So, presiona un poquito más, and you'll see. You can do it, Marvin. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, Jocelyn, is that por ahí? Are you around? In the hammock. <laughs> okay. Okay, perfect. So, Jocelyn, I'm going to take you. Eh, son 30 segundos. Select the topic, right? And uh, me avisa cuando esté lista. Let me know when you are ready. Okay. Um, what is the most dangerous job? Mm -hmm. uh, for me, uh, the first is the pilot. The pilot. 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 Mm -hmm. is very dangerous because 
is responsible for the, the people, uh, the all people mm -hmm. the, in the travel. And mm -hmm. the other, the other uh, jobs is uh, the police, policies, mm -hmm. because Time is over. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, time is over. It's only 30 seconds. So we definitely necesitamos más tiempo, I know. But thank you so much, Jocelyn. That was all right. Now, guys, let me just uh, move on a little bit with part of the activities that we have, and then we just continue here. So, tengo el último ejercicio de eh, gramática para el día de ahora. Vamos a terminar con una speaking activity, que es el minute presentation. Pero antes de avanzar con la presentación, let's take a look at this one. Um, it says here, write sentences using the words in parentheses. Ayúdame con la uno, guys. Help me with number one. Pick up always in tables. ¿Cómo la ordenarían? How would you put it together? ¿Cómo la ordenan, guys? Eh, me hace falta el sujeto, así que le podemos inventar palabras acá. I, my sister, you, my brother, my friend. So, number one, ¿quién me ayuda con la primera? Who wants to help me with number one? Uh, my sister always, always pick up tables. Okay, very good. My sister always, exactly, esa es la posición adecuada. My sister always. Y como es tercera persona, picks up tables. Very good. Number two, guys, who wants to go with number two? ¿Quién me ayuda con la segunda? Who wants to help with the second? Anybody? He, Sheldon, Shane's a menu. Very good. So he seldom, y como es he, siempre le vamos a agregar la S, he, sells, he seldom changes the menu. Very good. Number three, Moses, ayúdeme con la tres, porfa. Higher. She, uh, she hires rarely new employees. Ella okay. trata rara veces nuevos empleados. Ok, uh, solo una cosita con el orden. So, one more time, let's do it. She. She, uh, rarely. Mm -hmm. uh, hire new employees. Very good, that is the correct one. So, she rarely hires new employees. Excellent. Number four, who has number four? Danny? Ok. Uh, she has number four. She heard something close. Mm, can you repeat it, please? Uh, she heard mm -hmm. something close. Mm, okay. Uh, so, normalmente tenemos como she está super bien. Y luego tenemos la frecuencia. ¿Cuál es la frecuencia? Early or sometimes? Sometimes. Okay. Entonces, uh, vayamos la poniendo junta. Mm. Uh -huh. She, she sometimes very close. Después de sometimes, llevo el verbo. She sometimes ah, close, close, close early. Early. Okay, yeah. very good. Tercera persona, necesito agregarle ese. She okay. sometimes closes early. Close. Super bien. Good, good, good. Number five. ¿Quién tiene la cinco? Who has number five? Eh, Norbert? Okay, teacher. Mm, give it a. If, for example, my company is every give it ways. Um, hardly ever promotional items. Okay, so vamos a ponerlo junto. My company, I like it. Me gusta que hemos comenzado con esa. So my company. Y luego necesito la frecuencia. ¿Cuál de estas es frecuencia? My company. Ok, hardly ever. 
So my company have you ever, y luego necesito el verbo. Mm -hmm. Gives. So Give my company away. hardly ever gives away promotional items. Exactly. So remember, sujeto, frecuencia, verbo. Right? That is the order. And number six. Jackie, ¿está por acá? Anita, are you around? Mm -hmm. Teacher. Hello. Uh, in my store. Mm -hmm. My store. Um, never, never close on Monday. Okay, super bien. Exactly. My store never closes on Monday. Thank you so much. Very good. So just remember, ellos tienen un orden en específico. Good, 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 everybody. Look, um, tenemos a couple of minutes. Yeah, I think we do have enough time. Um, so, teníamos el día de ayer, estábamos trabajando con esta parte de acá, que es a day in the life of, right? Teníamos un poquito de speaking practice eh, y e íbamos a preparar una presentación cortita, súper cortito, de un minuto hablando de estos empleos. Now, my question is, um, are you ready for this? ¿Están listos? Are you quite ready? A little. A little. <laughs> ok, who is ready? Es un minuto, guys, del empleo que ustedes hayan elegido. You can practice it, pueden tener las notas, right? Pero la idea es say it, you know, say it. So, vamos a escuchar a los compañeros, pero necesito que pongan mucha atención porque vamos a hacer preguntas de lo que el compañero dijo. So pay attention to your classmates, right? Pay attention to what they are saying. Um, and that will be the last. So, ¿quién quiere comenzar? ¿Hay voluntarios? Es un minuto. It's one minute. You can do it, guys. Pueden hacerlo. Si se me queda alguien para mañana, van a ser dos minutos. <laughs> It's going to be two minutes. <laughs> okay. No, para que practique más, pues sí, you know. <laughs> so, okay. ¿Quién quiere pasar ahora? Who wants to do it today? Me. Pueden hacerlo mañana también. En tomorrow solo le agregamos un minutito más. 30 segundos, vaya, más. One minute 30. <laughs> Así practica listen, más. Listen yes, Carlos. Lo escucho un poquito lejos, pero yo creo que sí. I think we got you. Okay. So, un minuto. Yes. Okay. Deme un segundo, solo tomo el tiempo. Okay. Eh, ¿Cuál es el empleo? What is the job you selected? So, keeper. Ah, perfect. Okay, nice, nice. Vaya, vamos. One, two, three, go. Okay, the zoo keeper is a people that uh, working on the saw and take care of uh, the alimentation and food and health of many animals, uh, for example, lions, for example, giraffe, elephant, etc. He has a uh, many responsibility of the health of animals uh, and some sometimes he has a veterinarians and Curran, uh, no sé, how do you say Curran? Continue, continue, I don't want to stop you, continue. And 10 seconds. He is a important personal in the operation of the saw. Mm -hmm. Time is over, yes, Carlos, very good job. Nice, nice, that was really good. Very good description, very good grammar. Um, I liked it. I really understood what you were saying. Guys, preguntas. Um, what animals did Carlos mention? This mentioned lions. Lions. Elephant. Okay. <laughs> elephant. Giraffe. Elephant, elephants. Yeah. Did he say elephants? I remember yeah. he said giraffe. Yep. Okay. Elephant, lion. 
Ah, sí, yeah. dijo. <laughs> ok, ya, yeah, he said elephants. Ok, nice. Guys, comments. ¿Alguien tiene un comentario para Carlos? Any comment? Beautiful comment. Something that, I don't know, you want to mention. Se valen decir comentarios buenos. That was super good, Carlos. Thank you so much for that. Good. So, remember, pasamos ahora un minuto, pasamos mañana un minuto y medio. So, ¿quién es el siguiente? Who's next? Me. Yes. Ah, oh, ya ven si funciona. Ok. <laughs> ok, amazing, amazing. Un minuto, one minute. Oh quieren pasar ahora. <laughs> no, pues sí. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Uh, one, two, three, go. Okay, tonight I will explain about our preschooler teachers. Uh, before, uh, for example, if I will be a preschooler teacher, I need to wake up uh, really early and arrive to the school before of the children's. Um, I received them, uh, probably I received all my little children's with a big smile and uh, the best attitude. After uh, I explained some topics during the class, but I made, I make uh, with them, some games or activities. A seconds. I talking with my students and <laughs> and time is over. <laughs> okay, Karina, that was very, very nice. Very good description. That was really cool. Okay, guys, I have some question about Karina's uh, minute talk. So ¿Qué actividades, what activities um, she would be doing si fuera um, preschooler teacher? Emerson, algunas actividades. She mentioned some activities. Prepare the topic. Explain the topic. Okay, explain the topic. ¿Qué más? <laughs> okay, what else? Explain the topic. Play with children. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, we can take it, definitely. The, okay, the Karina, well, that was nice. No, punish, no. <laughs> no, right, Karina, no lo mencionó. She didn't say yeah. that. <laughs> like, castigar los Spanish children? Ah, no. No, right? <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, quisiera, no. pero no se puede. <laughs> okay. One activity is the write on the blackboard. Uh -huh. Well, yeah. Eh, well, les, les acabo de escribir en el chat eh, solamente these two things. Eh, lo que acaba de mencionar Dani es Spanish, de castigar, all right? Spanish. Karina no lo mencionó. <laughs> Pero para que les quede la palabra there, Spanish es castigar. Yeah. No importa física, verbal, Spanish. And uh, una palabrita, eh, Carlos anterior, era Zoom. Right, que vibra un poquito zoom. Lo demás super bien, guys. Very nice, good so far. Okay, siguiente. Who is next? <coughs> next, 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 next. Teacher. Oh yeah, it's true. No se quería ser el primero. Okay, but no worries. It's never too late. Yeah, okay, it's okay. okay. Today I will be uh, the patrol officer. Okay, go for it. Okay. <laughs> this is my, it's for, for example, okay. Of course. Okay, I work, okay. No, pero no es una. <laughs> I work as a couple mm -hmm. and, and we are in charge of monitoring the coastal road. <laughs> our patrol car is fast and has a powerful low speaker. Mm -hmm. And to communicate with the drivers, mm -hmm. and that um, the road is traveled by many cargo trucks, and we check mer merchandise. 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 Check, uh -huh. Yeah, we check the merchandise. 
and um, okay. um, mm. that that they carry in the containers. Um, we are I'm, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to stop you. That was nice. So I believe uh, in the, the sen <laughs> yeah, sentí la descripción como una película, una película de Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> so like I was like I imagined the, the whole movie when you were saying it. Very nice job, Ignacio. Good vocabulary. I like that. Um, you know, se nota que busco like some specific words to describe it. Very very cool. Thank you. Yeah. Who is next? Siguiente next guys. Hi teacher. All right, perfect, Moses. Very nice. One minute. All right. So go for it. For example, actor. Oh, okay. Okay, for example, uh, the profession of actor, famous, is interesting and funny because uh, uh, they uh, uh, go in Hollywood, for example, in, in action movie, uh, for example, uh, Passion Furious. It's, 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 it's interesting because you can hear a lot of money in acting. Also because it is one of my favorite uh, uh, movies. movies? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, 10 seconds. Almost. I also think that it's a complicated job due to carry out the essence for the field. It's a profession for me that needs a lot of dedication. Uh, I believe the actors, uh, people. Uh... Time is over. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Moses, that was nice. That was really good. So I, I like the way you presented it. And, and I like what you mentioned at the end. So definitely, it's a job that needs a lot of dedication. And uh, and I, I also heard that you wanted to become an actor. So I was like, okay, <laughs> great. Thank you so much. So hopefully you have the opportunity, you know, to take some acting classes and become an actor. Thank you for that. Um, next, guys, who goes after Moses? Next, next. Me, teacher. Yeah, Hi. perfect. Perfect, perfect. So... Es un minuto so far, and after you, we will have Brian, okay? So cuando esté lista, whenever you're ready, go. Okay. Uh, a florist is uh, a day in the life. Mm -hmm. My day starts very early mm -hmm. because the best flowers are found early. Mm -hmm. Having a florist requires a lot of creativity. Mm -hmm. There are different types of arrangements. Arreglos. Yes. Uh, either with chocolates, sweets, sweets, and everything that the clients can think, think of okay. to all. Okay. We make arrangements for birthdays. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to stop okay. you. All right, but that was nice today. I like the way you presented it. Arrangement, exactly, like arreglos florales, right? Okay. So like thank some you. arrangements, nice. Arrangement. That was a very good description. Okay, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. That was nice. Guys, I'm, I'm to be honest with you, I'm super impressed. I'm really impressed. Good pronunciation so far. Muy buena gramática, muy buen vocabulario. Wow, really, really good. Brian, vamos Brian, you can do it. One minute. Okay, I I told the target. Uh, <clears throat> we have a tour 
path is foam because you know different place inside or outside the country. Uh, we may place like, for example, the Pital in Chalatenango, the Salto de Malacatipan in Aguachapan City, of the Volcano Pilatmatepet in Santa Ana. Uh, we can travel, uh, enjoy, meet more people, take excellent photograph and enjoy the natural. Uh, we can uh, have glamping or visit different beach uh, outside the, the El Salvador. Uh, I don't know. You have four seconds. <laughs> okay. Sorry, my dog, my dog is... Uh, oh, no, it's fine, it's actually. Around. Yeah, your dog is barking. All He's right, barking. your dog barks. Okay, no problem. Actually, that was nice, Brian. That was a really good one. Right. I think you got tour guide, all right? And you mentioned the most important activities that a tour guide does. Eh, solo una cosita con la palabra eh, volcán, Volcano. right? Volcano. Volcano. Oh. Volcano, exactly. Volcano. So es como un A. Mm -hmm. Volcano. So they are volcanoes. La demás super bien. Good volcano. pronunciation. That's good. Only volcano, all right? Um, Okie dokie, guys, we do have like time for wine or probably two people. So next, who wants to do it today? Do hey. we have more volunteers? Me teacher. Okay, perfect. Go Norbert, one minute. Uh, I am Celex Joy, a marketing manager manager mm -hmm. uh, the manager the marketing manager is a dedicator um a sales the a determinator product mm -hmm. uh, um, the marketing manager use a um, uh, sell strategies uh, to use social uh, network uh, player eh, eh, business card como tarjeta yes. eh, y ears employers to meet goods eh, eh, to supervise your stay your stat eh, may make ready make ready and cash sales eh, Check the the cell report uh, every day. Uh, in and your I'm <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I have to stop you, but that was nice. All right, I think you have one of these technical uh, jobs because the activities they do are um, really technical vocabulary, talking about management. But I really like that. Um, que lo buscó, you know, that you investigated a little bit about those words. Yeah, so that was yeah. very nice. It's for, it's for my, my, my work. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah because the, the vocabulary is very technical. So, but nice, nice, nice. All right. So, guys, antes de irnos solamente a little bit, uh, les, quiero, les quiero mencionar un poquito de, de la platform. Um, okay, so I'm sorry to mention names, but uh, I think it's a little faster this way. So, para el día de ahora necesito que me ayuden con la unidad número dos, right? Y al igual que el midterm. So, por ejemplo, Anita ya me lo terminó. Uh, Claudia, estamos súper bien. Let me see. Eduardo también. Hey, Eduardo, very nice. Ya casi lo termina. Well, ya lo terminó. Wow. Okay. I see. Guadalupe, creo que estamos bien. I think we're good. Yes, we're good. Okay, we're super nice. Um, ya aquí estamos super bien también. So I see you complete. Thank you so much. Uh, Jocelyn, super bien. Ya vi, vi que me avanzó también con el resto. Ignacio, thank you. Wow, 100. Okay. 
Number super bien. Solo eh, creo que me le hace falta del midterm. Creo que me le hacen falta un ejercicio. If I'm not wrong. Karina, super bien. We are good. Now, mmm, Clary también ya lo terminamos. So we're nice. Let me just take a look. Moses, good, good, good. Ya estamos super bien. El midterm también. Nelson, yes. Thank you so much. Pedrina, super bien. Ya casi lo termina. René, estamos súper bien. Ya avanzó bastante. True. Eh, Richard, también solo creería que en el midterm me le falta un ejercicio. And um, Saraí, súper. Nice, nice. En Mabel, con la unidad 2 estamos súper bien. Solo me falta el midterm. Eh, creo que no me ha tomado el examen todavía. Eh, no, chicos, con el resto sí necesito que me ayuden para el día de ahora con el midterm. I need you to help me with the midterm. Eh, algunos ya me avanzaron con la unidad 2, but sí necesito que me ayuden con ambas, right? Midterm and the final eh, en unidad número 2. So, please, voy a revisar en un par de minutitos cuando ya hayan terminado la mayoría, right? Eh, solo confirmo asistencia de algunos que me hacían falta. I was missing. Teacher, I have a question. Dígame, Guadalupe. Eh, it's about the, 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 the job. Eh, mm -hmm. I'm sure the, the, the actor. I know the actor is for, for men, but in the list, I don't, I doesn't have a female. Um, no hay problema, there, there isn't any problem. Puede utilizar actress en vez de actor. Okay. Que sería para, para femenino, right? Actor and actress. That's okay. Actress. Solo haga el cambio para actress. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks. So, you're welcome. So, let me just make sure I got it. Eh, Mosa, solo me regala confirmación, porfa. Eh, Nelson también, solo me regala confirmación verbal, please, para que nos quede grabado. Thank you. Um, creo que René is not here. Bendita, sí. Eh, Claudia, creo que había Claudia por ahí. Present, teacher. Gracias, Miss. Thank you so much. Eh, do you see René? No, René is not there. Ok. Ok, guys, so thank you so much. Los que uh, nos hicieron falta el día de ahora, um, no lo tomen como un castigo or anything, no lo es, sino es la oportunidad de participar, guys. Yes. Whenever, siempre que tengamos la oportunidad de participar es algo positivo, because that means eh, me escuchan, yo no know, los puedo escuchar, y and, eh, puedo eh, también identificar si hay algo más que trabajar, you know, si hay que trabajar grammar, pronunciation, fluency, or anything else. So, un minuto 30 para el día de mañana, right? One minute 30, son los mismos jobs. Si usted le quiere dar más, si quiere llegar a los dos minutos, yo no me enojo. I'm really happy if you want to practice more, all right? Um, póngase enfrente del espejo, cinco minutitos, five minutes, no le va a tomar mucho tiempo. And guys, nos vemos el día de mañana. I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Have a wonderful night. And uh, solo ayúdeme con la platform, por favor. So, bye, at everybody. Moment, at this moment, I... Thank you. I yes, please. Thank you so much. I'll Good. see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Good night. night. Bye, guys. Bye. Good night. See you. See you. Deme un segundito. Ignacio, just give me one second. Ahí está. Ahí está. Ok, Ignacio, gracias por quedarse. Thank you so much. Solo le voy a robar acá un par de minutitos. I'm going to take some minutes from you. So, in general, solamente tengo como un poquito de feedback. Um, agradecerle, you know, porque es súper responsable con, con la asistencia. Siempre viene con todas las pilas puestas, like, a practicar. Um, Siento que ha avanzado bastante, so está desarrollando más fluidez, um, más vocabulario, so really, really nice. Gracias también por la plataforma, acabo de revisar y, y ya pues avanzó bastante, so cool.
¿Cómo se siente? How do you feel so far? Okay, I find to happy, so, so much happy because in, in, in so, so far, so far, far away time, mm -hmm. I to treat, uh, learn English mm -hmm. in another, in another, in, in Insafor. In Insafor. Okay. But, before but before yeah before before mm -hmm. at the at the ricardone in the mm -hmm. near, near to the university the, the la universidad yes. nacional yeah and in, in, in that time i have a a little problem with my health and oh. only 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 make a two or three module Oh. I can I can to continue, but I this see. moment, but this moment, uh, your your training is is very good. You you speak and you 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 have a a, a good good I, I in Spanish you you have a different technique for the learning in English and I am happy and 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 I like to continue. Nice, I'm happy yeah, to bonito. hear that. Eh, sí, me quiero decir que eh, sí estuve unos tres módulos este con Insafor en el Ricardone, entonces Yes, okay. I am and I understood you, you know, you know something interesting is that um I, I understand you like perfectly. You communicate your ideas very nicely. Uh -huh. So I understood that part. So you said that you were um, studying before, right? But, um, but I, I want to ask you this because I think I didn't ask you that before. So when you finish the program, uh, is there any goal that you have to learn English? Like for example, Sorry, <laughs> tell me. I like this. Yeah, I my my dream is is to speak mm -hmm. and uh, and listening for mm -hmm. to 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 understand English when the another people speak. I I I can understand so mm, okay your 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 speak your speaking i i don't know but uh, in i i i like um listen the music oh, I, nice. love the, uh, I i have a um app music for, um spotify for example oh okay in the Spotify, uh, I I can um, learn English the letter the letter songs, for example, and um, and uh, only the music <laughs> from sign the seventies only uh, in another eighties. Oh. So what, what is your favorite type of music? Like romantic music? No, soft rock, rock, soft. Rock, soft. for example? For example, um, Guns and Rose, uh, is, um, Chicago. It, oh. It, Chicago is a, is a band of the 70s. And I think I have heard it, okay. So you're yeah. more into like soft, soft uh -huh, music, soft, soft, soft rock. Okay. In, that that's in 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 I try to to learn English with the word the the sorry the lyrics the lyrics lyric mm -hmm. yeah lyric, lyric song mm -hmm. and and. Uh, the 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 lost time mm -hmm. lost, 
sorry, últimamente. What is the, in the lately? Lately? Lately, yeah, late, lately in the YouTube. In, in YouTube to different um, YouTuber to expose the the learn English with song. And is 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 beauty. It's it is a, a it is a really it, yeah it is a really good thing when you listen to the song you read the lyrics but then also you sing it because you exercise uh, your speaking ability. Um, there is something I can recommend you for listening to. Um, do you do you like listening to or do you like watching cartoons? Cartoons. In mm -hmm. Cartoons, for example, um, uh, yeah, uh, like the Flintstones, yeah. um, como los pica piedras, the Flintstones, the um, oh, I cannot remember any other. <laughs> okay, but one of the one of the best exercises that you can do, music is one. Music is really good. The second thing that I can recommend you is cartoon watch okay. cartoons in english okay. they in youtube you can find uh, some short videos that are maybe to one minute or two minute videos and the the english um speed the vocabulary and everything is uh, cartoons are for children right so the, yeah. the english level is not very complicated it is easy to understand. The pronunciation is good and you can repeat. So you listen and you can repeat. Uh, now that we finish the session, let me see if I can find um, a video. And so you can start working. You can start e exercising with cartoons. And if you like it, so that's perfect. Puedes seguir buscando más, right? You can continue looking for more because eso me ayudó bastante con listening listening to cartoons and yo escuchaba anime so listening to anime pero en inglés but in english so ayuda okay. bastante it helps a lot porque es como un inglés despacio pero muy bien pronunciado like really nice pronunciation so ahorita que terminamos se lo voy a compartir you know lo escucha y pues si le funciona y lo entiende, eh, aunque lo escuche 20 veces, you know? <laughs> la, idea, la idea del final es entrenar el oído, right? So, um, no le robo más tiempo, yo sé que ya, ya vamos a descansar, ok? So, gracias, thank you so much for your time, and nos vemos mañana, and I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Sí, eh, la veo mañana, hasta mañana. All right, yeah, bye-bye, see you tomorrow. See you.